Hey there guys, what's going on? It's Skills here and I'm back today with another episode of Journey to the Car. And in today's episode, I have done a little bit of off-camera work. Um, we went down at, well, first of all, we placed, uh, placed some, there was cobblestone on all in here. So if you use a Philosopher's Stone and you shift right click on a grass block or on cobblestone, it'll change it between the two. So we did that, I started hauling the land. And um, we got a couple of seeds placed down. So we have a little bit of food going on. And at this point, we can now go in here and oh. Oh yeah, we'll get we'll 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 go there in a minute. We can now get the potatoes, the carrots, and the we probably shouldn't get the melons yet, because I'm not sure how much room we're gonna have. Um I want to make sure if I do get the melons though, uh, I only want them to have one way to go. Uh, do let's just haul all of this then, which is going to use a lot of my iron, matic. But we need it needs to be done eventually. Alright, let's go repair it once more, and then we should have a nerve. And... There's the iron. And our iron matic. Alright, and let me just check. We also did get a bit more copper. Um, so I'm going to start pouring out a block of that. Um... Then let's go in here and finish this off. I also made some of our, like, a sheep's enclosure has now got that. Um, some of our chicken windows, well all of our chicken windows, and then some of our pig. Just to make it a little easier. Um, do, 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 do. Um, do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Trying to leave as many of the two block, <coughs> two block spaces as I can. Um. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, four. Oh, I'm gonna try and make it even. All right. Um. Then, oh, this will be a two block. But it can't be. So if we move you over two, you over two, you over two, you over two. No. It's not gonna work. You over two. Oh well. We'll just have to skip that one. But yeah, we have one, two, two, four, six, seven, eight. Plus, even if we climb the melon, like this one won't go off, will it? This one will. We can turn all them into melon seeds. And then place them accordingly. Boom, boom. 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 Oh, crap. Uh, boom. Please give me them back. Oh, that one didn't... No! Okay, we wasted two. That's okay, we can get more. Um, and that should be good for now. I can go put these all away. We have some baked potatoes left so I can eat them as and when I want to. Alright, but also... Our XP tank is full, so we're going to get a 30 levels. And then we can see what next one's 32. Okay, so we can get working towards that. Right, um, then our little um, copper block should be done. So we should be able to now finally make this pulverizer. Um, so we need to get the two iron ingots, turn our copper block into some 
ingots, do this, do make the two copper gears, then let's get our, our redstone reception coil, piston, our two diamonds, and our machine frame basic. Machine frame basic goes here, redstone reception coil will lower it. These two there, piston above, and then that there, and then we get a pulverizer. So weird. Um, redstone furnace. Uh, let's put. Let's move everything real quick. Um, okay. Right, let's put the. I don't know where where to put it. Let's uh, move this wall out. Oh. Hello. Uh, I'll take this. Why not get some Martin? <laughs> Every little helps. Um. Do. I saw this fall. Uh, I guess why not remove that as well? Well, right. Um, and then just one more should do it. Right, because then if we place the capacitor bank like here, a generator here, then we can get the pulverizer. Okay, I'm not sure if that was facing the right way. It was. Never mind. Um, and then our redstone furnace right there. And then we can start pulverizing some uh, to make steel. What was it? it was a coal, I think. Uh, molten steel uh, is made with a steel ingot in the smeltery, uh, which is then uh, made with iron and pulverized charcoal. Or iron and pulverized coal. So if I already have the coal, I would prefer to use that. Alright, and how much steel are we gonna need? We're gonna need one ingot. Um let's start off by just how much po how much air will this give even? Uh oh, okay. Um, I guess it just gives the one, okay. And then two, where, but we need someone else, don't we? Uh, where is this? Oh, it's right next to the molten steel. Alright, it needs an induction smelter. Induction smelter. Uh, so we're going to need Inva, the machine firm again. Which means tin gear. Right. Okay, let's get our let's get our stuff. So we're gonna need tin. All the tin. Please tell me we're not low on tin. Please. We have four. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's awkward. Oh, and also, during the stream, uh, Linda taught me how to put the Molten Ardite in here. So we now have Molten Ardite in here. Because we, we got it from that one quest a long time ago. Or was it a reward bag? It was one of the two. Um, and she taught me that you can just put, it, put like the thing on top of here. And then it just kind of did it. I wouldn't know how to replicate it. But thank you for that, Linda. Uh, so we can now make a p molten no not a molten an adite pickaxe head and then we will be able to mine a lot more stuff um i'm not going to apply it yet simply for the fact that uh this one still has use in it so i'll just chuck that in there uh, we have a tin Oh, never mind. Alright, let's have a look. Right, wait, what else do we need? We t tin Invar is made with... How do you make Invar again? 
I know it's like uh, nickel and iron. So let's get all our iron. Uh, there's some iron. N uh, wait, nickel is nickel ferrous. How do you get nickel? Oh, it is ferrous, okay. Ferrous. Uh, tin. Okay, so we can make a... Uh, wait, didn't we only need one t tin gear anyway? Ah, oh, so I could have just done that. And get the tin gear. And then we're going to need some redstone. And let's surround the tin gear and redstone. Dr. Redstone block. And then we get a new max servo. And then is it glass and iron? Yes. Okay, so now we need glass. So we have sand. I thought we already had some glass. I could have sworn... Oh, there we go. Please don't. Okay, good. I was like, if I accidentally place this down, I'm going to throw bats. Which, if Americans don't know what that mean, it means, like, punches. Um, I need gold. I like gold. I like gold. Alright, so we have the redstone reception coil. It, it, it is that one, isn't it? Okay. There's another one that's, like, the same kind of name, and I always get them mixed up. Not gonna lie. Uh, then we need Invar. So how do we make Invar again? Uh, iron and nickel. And nickel can be made with ferrous, right? Uh, yes. Okay, good. Uh, add it. Right, let's see. What does ferrous mix with? Molten nickel just mixes to make invar. And iron will mix with a lot of things. So if I have obsidian and aluminum... Wait, I already have iron in there, so it should be good. Oh, wait. Let's get the ferrous in there first. Then we'll put some more of the iron in there. Uh, wait. Oh yeah, we got another essence berry bush while it was while we did the stream, by the way. And if you, I didn't say it in video last week, um, I'm now going to be on Wednesday streaming off camera work. Um, so I make sure that I actually get it done because I sometimes do forget to do it. Not gonna lie. Uh, Inva nine ingots, perfect, perfect. Um, and then get more, and this should make us the full black, which means we need one more ingot of it, and boom bada boom, we should have everything we need now to make the induction smelter. Because I believe it was Invara there as well. And then with the reds... Oh, okay, I've done something wrong. Other way around. Oops. I was just about to say, if it's just that, then I was going to be mad. <laughs> well, not mad, but you guys know what I mean. It's going to be like, oops. Uh, can I just do that? Okay. I was trying to make that way more difficult than it was. And boom. And this should make a steel ingot so we can finally go to the nether. Um, setting up shop. This one just keeps doing it itself. Uh, select task. And that one should do it a lot quicker. Um, steel inger, then we need to get flint. I for completely forgot to check when I started recording this, so we'll make this real quick, and then in the next episode, we shall go to the nether. Okay, there we go. Flint and steel. Uh, claim that. 
select task. I could have sworn the flint and steel was like a quest somewhere. Uh, I don't even remember why I'm going the never, to be honest. Ah, oh, need steel to make this as well. Um, that's going to make the cactus, have that done. Thanks. Alright, that one I can't do, that one I can't do. Flint and steel. Oh, it wants me to manually submit it. Oh, but then that's giving me the ball of glue and... Ah. Uh, gives me the diamond block. Um. Right, well, I'll think about that off camera and we will get that sorted. Actually, why don't I just make a second ingot of steel? Duh. Uh, I'll put these two call in and I just want to say thank you guys all very much for watching. Uh, if you have enjoyed, then definitely check out all the links down below. Um, especially Empty Game, they have some awesome deals with our coupon codes uh, and a referral link, so check them out. Um, and yeah, just thank you guys for watching, and I will catch you guys all in the next one. Bye, guys.